So today I'm going to show you how to find uh, if a product you're looking at on Amazon has a lot of fake reviews. Now this can be uh, determined in a few ways, like one of them is that uh, a lot of products will give away a product for free in exchange for, for a review. They don't necessarily demand that the review is good, but it's been found that almost everyone that gets these free products rates the product highly. So that's a big problem because it makes the product look a lot better than it is. Also, a lot of products will just pay for reviews from some sketchy website uh, where people will come in and post these just very vague five-star reviews for a product. So that makes the product look a lot better than it is and makes it so that you're looking for something else that's probably better and cheaper, but this one, because it's rated highly, shows up first. So I'm going to show you how to kind of find out if the product you're looking at has good reviews or bad reviews, basically. So um, let's head over to Amazon. And just for example, let's uh, search for headphones. And then let's just uh, grab some of the first results. Um, this one looks already pretty sketchy because you can see all the buzzwords in the title. That's normally a bad indicator already. So it has uh, three and a half stars. And the reviews have a lot of pictures and everything. They look pretty good overall. So it'd be something that you'd probably look at and then uh, kind of right off the bat think that it's a good product. But um, the way to check if these reviews are actually legitimate or not is to use this uh, pretty cool website called uh, fakespot.com. So to use it, all you have to do is go to your product on Amazon and copy and paste the URL into the bar right here. So then uh, immediately you can see that this product definitely has a lot of fake reviews or paid for reviews. And it gives a bit more uh, information here that we'll go through. So if you see any product that gets an F, generally right off the bat that's a really really bad sign like I've seen some B or C products where I kind of don't think that fake spot was perfect on it and that the reviews were more legitimate than they thought uh, but if it has an F then almost right off the bat you're you should be concerned so it gives reasons right here why it thought it was fake and uh, so it said that uh, their engine detected pod product exchange for reviews so basically that product gave away free product to reviewers to give them reviews but Usually, usually, like I said, those are uh, almost always high ratings. So we can go um, back to the reviews themselves and check around, and almost immediately you can see uh, right here that he was given the headset for free to test and review and gave it five stars. But that's five stars on a product with a lot of one and two stars, so it definitely seems a little sketchy. And then um, this one also says that it uh, got a Free, got a free product or discounted product for review, and again, it's five stars. So, um, like I said, this one would be a hard one to trust. But then let, let's look at a little more known product, like a, a Bose headset here. This has 3,400 views, um, so let's search that one. Let me just go back to the home page here and paste it. And uh, this one has an A, basically. So over 90% of the products can verify, uh, the reviews it can verify were good reviews. The other 10%, it doesn't necessarily mean that they were fake reviews, it just couldn't determine if they were or not. So um, overall, this one looks like it matches the reviews. Uh, it doesn't necessarily mean this is the product you want to buy, but you can at least uh, know that probably the reviews match what the product is. So um, it's a it's important distinction to make, and this works really well. So uh, that's how you how you spot fake reviews on Amazon.